What is up guys, it is Tim tonight here and today welcome back to another Black Ops 4 Zombies video and in this video we're going to be talking about more DLC 1 leaks. This will probably be a very short video but I still want to talk about the leak because I honestly like making discussion videos like these. Also, since I will be talking about leaks, I'm going to put a spoiler warning just in case you guys don't want to be spoiled. But honestly, you guys probably don't care, but since we got that out of the way, let's get right into the leak. A user over on Reddit was in custom mutations when all of a sudden they saw the DLC 1 map in the map select menu. Now, the map is going to be called Night of the Dead or Night of the Undead, and this is a rough translation since the screenshot was in French, but the description of the map reads, Night of the Undead. England 1912, Relics Hunter, Ali Stair Rhodes, among which a Pseudo Psychic, a Show Cowboy, a Retired General, and his faithful butler are invited to participate in a big ball, but nobody knows what horrors are waiting for them. Like I said, a rough translation. Also in the pic, you can see the ray gun like one weapon, which is really cool. It looks freaking sick. And in the background, you can see the mansion where the map will be taking place in. It might just be the picture, but the mansion doesn't look too huge, so this might not be a big map like Voyage of Spare. The map might be as big as 9, or who knows, this might be a small close quarters map. If that is the case, I hope it isn't too difficult. There will be all sorts of boss zombies, so if it's a small close quarters map, I don't know how to feel about that. The Darkest Shore was a close quarters map, and I honestly hated it. But this is all just rumors and speculation. We don't know for sure how big the map is going to be. All we know is that the map is the inside of a mansion. So it's not going to be a huge map. But hopefully it's not a map where I'll see a boss zombie every time I turn a corner. I really want this map to be fun and enjoyable. And cater to both noobs and hardcore players. But I guess for zombies really hasn't been catering to the new players so much. So it would be nice if we have a map that's sort of noob friendly. That's why I like the Rise and Drock so much. It catered to both noobs and hardcore players. But that's going to be it for this video. A really quick video talking about deals one of Black Ops for Zombies and my hopes for the new map. If you guys enjoyed today's video, be sure to smash the like button down below and subscribe if you are new for more Black Ops for Zombies content. But my name is Tim Tanaya here. Hope you guys have a wonderful day. Just keep those positive vibes flowing, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.